Earlier this week, the United Kingdom's defense intelligence update for the Ukraine conflict using satellite imagery showcased Russia to have parked two MiG-31K interceptor aircraft in Belarus on the 17th of October. The aircraft is supposed to be equipped with hypersonic AS-24 Killjoy, known as Kinzhal or Dagger in Russian, ballistic missiles, which Russia has fielded since 2018. Having adapted the MiG-31K to carry this specific munition, the satellite imagery showed the two-seat supersonic interceptor aircraft with a large canister stored within a protective earth beam nearby. This canister specifically has led to the assumption that the Kingjoy ballistic missiles have also been taken to Belarus by Russia, as the canister is usually associated with the Kingjoy missile. So what are the features of the Big 31K and AS-24 Kingjoy missile? Developed as a variant of the MiG-25 Foxbat, the first prototype of the MiG-31 MiG Foxhound flew in September 1975. Both were designed by the then Soviet Mikoyan and Gurevich Design Bureau. By 1982, the MiG-31s were operational with the Soviet Air Defense Forces. Essentially, it is a long-range, two-seat, supersonic interceptor equipped with state-of-the-art digital avionics. The MiG-31 is also an air-to-air -air combat fighter. Currently, it's in service with both the Russian and Kazakh Air Forces. The MiG-31K is a variant of the MiG-31 tailored to carry the Kinzer missile. The MiG-31's reported length is 74.5 feet, its height is 20.2 feet, and it has a maximum speed of 3000 km per hour, thus falling in the supersonic category. The aircraft also has a range of 3000 km. Significantly, the MiG-31 was the first Soviet fighter to have both look-down and shoot-down capability. This refers to the ability of a radar system to detect, track, and guide a munition towards an alien mobile target that's moving below its horizon, essentially below its viewpoint. This enhances a fighter's attack capability. Now moving to the AS-24 Killjoy missile, the AS-24 Killjoy or Kinzhal ballistic missiles which are supposed to be in the canisters next to the MiG-31Ks in Belarus, are essentially hypersonic air-to-air -air surface missiles. Certain reports suggest that the missiles are capable of carrying nuclear payloads as well. According to the British intelligence update earlier this week, the Killjoys have been deployed occasionally throughout the Ukraine war. Further, as the missiles have a range of 2,000 kilometers, Placing them in Belarus gives Russia little advantage in striking additional targets in Ukraine, according to British intelligence. Though unconfirmed reports also suggest that the Killjoys can operate at a maximum speed of Mark 12, which is 12 times the speed of sound. This makes them faster than the high mobility artillery rocket systems, which have been supplied by the US to Ukraine, and these HIMARS have been part of the news cycle and have been covered extensively because they have been integral to Ukraine's defense and counterattack through the summer and preceding fall this year. Succeeding fall, rather. The speed of the Kinzhals could give Russia an advantage. This has led to speculation that Ukraine's air defense systems would only be able to shoot down 20% of the Kinzhal missiles. For the print, this is Suchet Peek Singh. For more, log on to the print.in and follow us on social media.